Okay, so today we're gonna be making some bread. We're in Miss Carrie's house. Um, every Saturday she goes to this like market where she sells all her like goat milk, her goat cheese. Well, I'll let her talk about that. So here, she can tell you all that she does. I sell um, all raw dairy products at the Hale Farmers Market at Hale Plantation and also sell uh, baked goods and jellies and um, specialty items uh, weekly. could vary. It could be cookies, muffins, or this week I'm going to try to do some uh, brownies in a ice cream cone. So. But anyways, uh, Marie's going to be making fluffy milk rolls today. I already measured out all the ingredients and they're all right here. And the reason why I have this cat thing on is not because I lost all my hair. It's because I don't want hair in the um, bread because she's going to be selling this. And I don't think anybody would want to eat my hair. Okay, so I measured all the stuff. Um, so here's my list. And it's all in grams, don't worry about that. It's all this. So, yeast, milk, eggs, all that. So, first, I'm going to put um, what? the yeast. Where is that? Right here. See? Gonna put that in here. And now my milk, which that is right here. And you can tell the yeast is 20 grams, and now the milk. Is 100 or no 850. So I don't know if I can do this. Now the eggs, which that is five eggs. The cream cheese, which I'm gonna do that last because that might need a spatula. And no, the cream cheese. Now I'll get her to do that because that's gonna be hard. And when I put in the sugar, the, I mix the sugar and the salt together. So that was all in this pink bowl when I put it in. So now I'm going to start mixing it. And when it gets to like a good mixture, then I'm going to put in the flour. And when I put in the flour, I'm going to see if it's like sticky and stretchy. And if it's still that, then I'll put in this extra flour. And then when it's all good, then I'll put in the butter which is right there. Well, it's in there, Milton-ish. So, yeah. So, she, Miss Carrie says it's her favorite because she broke her KitchenAid. Now I'm going to be doing the flour and it is 1,550 grams, so yeah. Okay, so I just added the last little bit of um, flour and right now I'm waiting for it to like get to a thick like texture and I spilt some so she's cleaning it up for me. But if it gets too sticky, then I'll put in that extra stuff to make it like a, um, uh, what do you call it? Smooth. Yes. So that's it right now. And we're just going to wait a little bit until it fluffens up or smooths down, something like that. And then, yeah.
But we're gonna put it in the oven with the oven off with um, boiling water with and with the light on. We're gonna put it in there. We haven't boiled the water yet, but that's the pan. And then we're gonna put that in there and it's gonna rise and yeah. Okay, so we just took it out of the oven, Ooh. and it has rose a lot from when we first put it in there. As you can see, it's gotten very tall. It was like to right here when I first put it in, somewhere around there, and now it's way up here. So now we're going to like mold it into the rolls, I think. Okay, so while we're waiting for the bread to bake, um, Miss Carrie is going to show me how you milk a goat. I've milked a cow before, but she's just going to show me how I milk a goat. And first we're going to be milking Penny. Penny, and she's already ready. So, yeah. You don't have to go so high up. You can just right there. Yep. Okay, so when we're um, milking the goats, she put in some bread, and now they're all done, and they are very, very fluffy, and they look very good. So I'm about to eat one right now, but look how good. I just want to eat them all. I probably could eat them all, but she's got to sell some, but I will take some home. So she's making me some right now with some butter, so they look good. <laughs> 